Here we are on Sunday of our second week of physical distancing, which I hope we've been doing before, um, but also our second week of um, not going out and being inside and all the things that we're trying to do to help the situation. So I'm going to just jump right in into the 20 minute practice today with only a few minutes or a few moments of just getting everyone settled in. So if you've joined me already in the two other classes that are two other practices that I led on last Sunday and on Thursday at 9 a.m. Pacific and noon um, Eastern Time U.S., which it should be right now. Uh, we had our clocks go back, so I'm hoping I got that worked out. Uh, then you'll know that we just need uh, a warm place or a place to lie down. So uh, you can use a yoga mat, you can use a blanket, you can use your bed. If you're not comfortable lying down, you can always do this practice seated. It's just a little bit easier to do lying down if you're comfortable that way. And then if you'd like, you can have uh, a little blanket for the back of your neck and head. You can have a blanket underneath your knees, so when you're on your back, your back, low back is comfortable, and it's good support for your body. So, like I said, I'm, we're going to jump in pretty much right away. Um, just go ahead and set yourself up comfortable, and uh, comfortably, excuse me, that you really want to set yourself up as if you were setting yourself um, or setting up your best friend. So imagine all the things that you could do for your best friend. Make yourself really, really comfortable. Do you have a blanket? Do you have a blanket underneath you? Uh, will you be warm? You'll notice I'm still in my down jacket so I can stay warm in the house that my kind friend, uh, her vacant house that my kind friend has offered me to do these sessions in. And as always, if you're uncomfortable at any point in time and you feel like you should come out of the practice, please simply come out of the practice. Take a few moments and ground yourself from where you are, look around, re rejoin um, the present moment if you need to, but it should be completely safe. Everybody I've ever done it for has um, been okay and fine, but I'm speaking to the world now, so everyone's different, and I just want you to know that you can always come out. You don't have to stay in. These are just guided suggestions. Uh, anything else? Let's see. Um, oh, yeah, at the end, we're going to come out, and if there's any questions, I'll stay on for a few moments, and feel free to type them in and let me know what they are. Okay, let's go ahead and move over to where I can sit comfortably and you guys can get set up and all warm. So again, on your back with a blanket underneath your knees or another towel and something underneath the cervical spine or the head and in a uh, supine position on the back. Okay, so let's begin our practice. Gently close your eyes. Allow yourself to take notice of your body breathing. Nothing to change, nothing to alter, just the body breathing. Allow the sounds that exist in the space that you're practicing to simply rest on the ears. They're coming and just allow the sounds just as if my just as my voice is coming to rest and you'll hear the voice. You're not reaching out for the voice or straining for the voice. 
or any sound in particular in the room. You're simply noticing the sounds and allowing them to be. Notice the temperature of the room. If you need to, when you're just beginning, if you need to grab anything that can make you feel warmer or cooler or you need to remove anything, please do so now so that you can be comfortable through the duration of the practice. With yourself settled back in again take notice of the breath the body breathing in your supine position with your body breathing you're noticing just simply existing in the space that you're in, allowing the sound of my voice to rest on your ears, allowing the other sounds that may be coming in through this audio tape or this video or the sounds in your room just to simply exist. Letting yourself be comfortable and present for the next several moments as I take you through a simple guided meditation where we'll look and rest our awareness in our mind's eye on a specific part of the body. We'll do it quickly and gently, moving from one part of the body to the next. allowing the brain and the body to connect as well as relax. So like all meditations that I offer up, this is for the benefit of all beings. And if you'd like to set your intention, your resolve, it may be something that you want to be or become or experience. If you had one from the prior two meditations that we did on Sunday and last Thursday, feel free to use that one again. If you're a little uh, bit struggling or wondering what the right, quote, air quotes, um, resolve or intention should be, it's whatever first comes to your mind. And if you need a little cue, it can just simply be, I'm experiencing calm. I'm experiencing peace. I'm experiencing ease. Any quality or characteristic that you feel as if you could use a little bit more support in, that you would love to experience more fully. Please state that intention or resolve in a positive manner to oneself now. With your mind's eye, we're going to move from different parts of the body. We'll begin with the right hand. Please take your awareness to your right hand. Your right hand thumb, second finger, third, fourth, fifth, palm of the hand, back of the hand. We're moving our awareness quickly and gently through these areas. 
wrist, lower arm, elbow, upper arm, shoulder, armpit, waist, hip, right thigh, kneecap, calf muscle, ankle, heel, sole of the right foot, top of the foot, right toes, one foot, the first toe, second toe, third, fourth, fifth. Please take your awareness to the left hand, the left hand thumb, second finger, third finger, fourth finger, fifth finger. Palm of the left hand, back of the hand, wrist, lower arm, elbow, upper arm, shoulder, armpit, waist, hip, left thigh, kneecap, calf muscle, ankle, heel, sole of the left foot, top of the left foot, all left foot toes, the first toe, second toe, third, fourth, fifth. Return to the right toes and start from the bottom. The right big toe, second toe, third, fourth, fifth. Top of the foot, sole of the right foot, heel, ankle, calf muscle, kneecap, thigh, hip, waist, armpit, shoulder, upper arm, elbow, lower arm, wrist, back of the right hand, back of the, or excuse me, palm of the hand, right thumb, second finger, third, fourth, fifth. Go to the left toes, the left big toe, second toe, third, fourth, fifth. Top of the left foot, sole of the left foot, heel, ankle, calf muscle, kneecap, thigh, hip, waist, armpit, shoulder, upper arm, elbow, upper, excuse me, lower arm, wrist, back of the hand, palm of the hand, left thumb, second finger, third, fourth, fifth. Again, we're just taking the awareness through the body lightly and easily. We're going to go to the back of the body. Go to the back of the head where it touches the floor. The back of the head, the right shoulder blade, the left shoulder blade, the entire spine, the right hip, the left hip, the right buttock, the left buttock, back of the right thigh, back of the left thigh, back of the right knee, back of the left knee, the right calf, the left calf, right ankle, left ankle, right heel, left heel. Okay, we're going to return up the body. Right ankle, left ankle, right calf muscle, left calf muscle, back of the right knee, back of the left knee, back of the right thigh, back of the left thigh, right buttock, left buttock, right hip, left hip, the whole spine, the right shoulder blade, the left shoulder blade, the back of the head. Now down the front side of the body, go to the front of the body, go to the top of the head, the top of the head, the forehead, the right eyebrow, left eyebrow, the space between the eyebrows, the right eyelid, left eyelid, right eye, left eye, right ear, left ear, right nostril, left nostril, right cheek, left cheek, upper lip, 
lower lip, chin, jaw, throat, right collarbone, left collarbone, right chest, left chest, the middle of the chest, the navel, the upper abdomen, the lower abdomen, right groin, left groin, right thigh, left thigh, right knee, left knee, right toes, left toes. Return up the front of the body, right toes, left toes, right knee, left knee, right thigh, left thigh, right groin, left groin, lower abdomen, upper abdomen, navel, right chest, left chest, middle of the chest, right collarbone, left collarbone, throat, jaw, chin, lower lip, upper lip, right cheek, left cheek, right nostril, left nostril, right ear, left ear, right eye, left eye, right eyelid, left eyelid, right eyebrow, left eyebrow, eyebrow center, the forehead, the top of the head. Lastly, the major parts of the body, the whole of the right leg, the whole of the left leg, both legs together, the whole of the right arm, the whole of the left arm, both arms together. the whole of the back all together. The whole of the front all together. The entire head. Now the entire body. the whole body all together. Visualize the whole body. Feel the awareness of the whole body at rest. This is the entire body at rest. Return your awareness to your breath. Allow all of the body to be breathing. Each in-breath easy and calm. Each out-breath relaxed and steady. It's a natural breath, no force, nothing to change, easily in and out of the body. Take a few moments here as you count the breaths to just allow yourself to go from the number 27 down to one. So each breath is a count. So the in breath is 27, the out breath is 27, the next in breath is 26, the next out breath is 26. 
for me personally, I like to focus on the out breath. So I count with each out breath, beginning at 27 and going down to one. If I lose my way and my mind goes off, I simply return to 27 and begin again. Please begin counting down from 27 to one with your breath, an easy natural breath, not forced, not lengthened, just simply counting. Please cease counting and return to just simply observing the breath, watching the breath go in and out of the body. Inhalation, easy and calm. Exhalation, natural and relaxed. The body is breathing. The body is at rest. Please recall the intention or the resolve or the statement that you made at the beginning of the practice and please recite it to yourself three times. If you don't exactly recall how you stated it, it's okay. It's all practice. Again, return your awareness to your natural breath, your easily and, and calmly breathing. Notice the physical relaxation as well. Become aware of both the physical relaxation and the ease in which you are breathing in this moment. Gently begin to move the toes and the fingers, gently coming out of this easeful practice. Feel free to circle your ankles and your wrist. Feel free to stretch your arms up and overhead if you're lying down or seated. Bend one leg and then the other and roll to your right side. Take a moment here. And then use your top arm to help yourself up to a seated position. 
If you haven't already opened your eyes, open your eyes. If you've come into this practice, probably uh, in the last few minutes, we just did a simple yoga nidra practice where we went through the body and we went through in a very quick manner to help the uh, brain and body come to a more state of homeostasis. If some of you know me, um, then you know that I've been studying functional medicine for going on um, five years now, and I'm really feeling comfortable with the material. I'm looking forward to sharing more about it. So if you have any questions on how some of my past history of yoga teaching and green environmental design all mix up into become this person now known as um, a functional medicine educator, or actually not educating or functional medicine, but excuse me, I should say that differently, a wellness educator um, with a strong uh, emphasis on understanding things functionally through the functional medicine paradigm. I don't teach functional medicine, so <laughs> just to make that clear, I'm learning it and trying to practice it with myself and helping other uh, people along the way. So please type in if you um, have any questions, let me know. If you have any comments, let me know. Let's see. And use this other screen. Okay. All right, no comments. So I suppose we'll um, continue with the mindful minutes at nine. Uh, Pacific time and noon um, Eastern. Uh, hi, Christina. Hi, Jeff. All these people. Thank you. So just let me know what you are liking. Uh, I think the mindful minutes are actually getting more views, so I might continue those and move the more practices to another place. But um, let me know what you're enjoying and how we can help each other through these days of um, I'm not certain how to call it. Somebody called it safe down. That's okay. Good to see you, Christina. It's okay. There's a, you can always do a replay and, um, I hope you take the time for yourself to make everything all right in the world where you are. I'll talk to you soon all and see you soon. Bye-bye. <laughs>